Bishan Stadium, the home of the Protectors, was the site of the Great Eastern Yo's S League 2013 matchup between Home United FC and Geelang International FC. Both teams were relatively level form wise and were looking all set to kickstart the match to get all three points for their own team. Home United FC playing on home territory were lying in fourth position, level with Belestia Khalsa FC below them on goal difference. Geelang International, on the other hand, were on ninth position but just one point below Brunei DPMM. The game started with a rather slow pace as both teams were keen on dictating the speed of play to their own playing style. Both sides were giving away possession rather cheaply as very few shots were mustered in the opening stages of the game. As the game picked up, Home United were the side with a slight edge in possession as they widened the play to the wings to cross the ball in many occasions as possible. The quick counter-attacking pace of the Eagles soon paid its dividends as one particular counter-attack saw two Geelong forwards race forward, completely dismantling the Home United defence as Joseph Kaplan found himself one-on-one -on -one with the keeper. Keeping his composure, he fired the ball low and hard into the back of the net as the Eagles finally took the lead. Having conceded the goal, the Home United team went forward more aggressively in search of the equaliser but was unable to find it in the first half as they went to the dressing room at halftime, still a goal down. The second half saw a completely rejuvenated Home United side as they had clearly upped their game which could be seen from the accurate and sharp passing. They also chased down every ball putting the Geelang players under immense pressure. The equaliser came in the 76th minute as the referee awarded a controversial penalty to the protectors. Shouts of diving and cheating were heard from the crowd but the number 13 Lee Kuan Wu kept his school and dispatched the spot kick with ease. The goal had breathed new life into the Home United side as they pressed harder to find the winning goal against the clearly drained Geelang side and in the closing stages they found the net once more. Just five minutes after the equaliser, another cutting edge attack from the Home United side saw them take the lead through Kwon Dak Yung. A looping header from the number 9 forward saw the protectors finally take the lead. In the end, it was the protectors that managed to hold on to their controversial lead as the Eagles were downed in the Bishan Stadium with a scoreline of 2-1. Uh, I saw a very good teamwork. Uh, defensively, I think we worked very hard. Uh, we are not frightened to play a uh, top team like Home United. I think they are a class team with uh, quality players. You look at the, <coughs> the 11 players. They had six national and ex-national and five foreigners. Um, we played. We gave them. I know they are, they are a good team. Uh, we matched them. We we gave them. Uh, we went neck to neck with them. I think credit to my boys. Uh, uh -huh.